It's one thing to talk about saving money by consolidating your debt into your mortgage, and it's another to see it in action. In today's lesson, I want to show you a real-life case study of a client I funded a loan for today that's able to save $1,500 a month on their new mortgage or take that money and pay their new loan off in only seven years even and save over $100,000 in interest charges. Hi, this is Robert Weinberg, and on this channel, we empower people to take control of their financial future through expert mortgage and financial strategies. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Also hit the bell so you get notified on all of our future content. So in this lesson today, I want to show you a real life case study of a mortgage that I funded today for a client that's saving over $1,500 per month, but is actually going to take that money and apply it to their mortgage to now have their home paid in, in seven years flat. So before they came to me with their scenario, they had 17 years left on a 30-year mortgage. They also had a second mortgage that was a line of credit, and they had a pool loan. So they took out a personal loan for a pool on their property. And last but not least, they had 15,000 in credit card debt that accumulated over the last couple years just in day-to-day -day life making ends meet. So their total monthly payments that they had were $2,600 per month, including the property taxes and the home insurance. And let me show you here how that broke down. So I have this analysis spreadsheet I do for all my clients for debt consolidation. You can see their current budget here. So we have the two mortgages, the aqua finance, which is the pool loan, and then we have this credit card debt here that they were making a little bit over the minimum or the minimum payments on most of these cards. So the total current payments is $2,600 per month. So now, by refinancing into a new 30-year mortgage, we were able to take them down from $2,600 a month down to a minimum payment for 30 years at $1,090 per month. If you do the math, that saves them $1,500 per month. And you can see here, $1,509 is the actual exact savings, over $18,000 a year, and almost $100,000 just in the first five years alone. But here's where it gets better is by them actually taking that money, that 1500 that we're saving them per month, and applying that to their new mortgage principal. They're able to have this 30-year mortgage paid off in only seven years, 84 months flat, which is gonna save them over $115,000 in interest charges. So let me show you how that breaks down here. So their new mortgage is 170,000 at 4.62% for 30 years. You can see we're gonna apply an extra 1500 a month, which is the amount most of the amount here from their monthly savings to the principal. And then you can see the amortization schedule here. So we're now paying that 30 year loan off in only seven years flat, 84 months. And the total interest they're gonna save by doing that is $115,206.18 by paying that loan off so soon. Now this makes sense for this particular client because they plan on retiring in 10 years. So now they're gonna have their house paid off in uh, seven years, which is definitely gonna be by the time they retire. But here's where this gets really interested in, uh, interesting, is that not only does it set them up for the short term by getting their budget in line and paying their house off early, but it also buffers them from financial setbacks in the future because now they have an extra $1,500 per month that they were sending to interest on their credit cards, mortgages, and other loans. Now they have that as a buffer, as a margin, as we call it, and they can use that money for whatever they want. Now their ultimate goal is to use that money to pay the house off, but let's look at real life scenario, which is something could come up in six months, a year, a couple of years from now, and they have a setback and they need an extra 500 a month or a thousand a month. Now they don't have to use the credit cards in order to get that money. They have that money in their budget by utilizing this debt consolidation refinancing strategy. Before doing this, they only had one option, and that was to either raid their retirement fund, which is a huge no-no, or even worse, using a credit card to take care of it or a personal loan and just adding on to the debt. Now they don't have to do that anymore. They've got the extra 1500 a month in their budget. So if they step back and they have to pay that $1,090 minimum payment, that 30 year payment, if they have to fall back on that a couple months over the next seven years, it's not gonna be a big deal. They're still gonna have their house paid off 
in a significant uh, amount shorter time than they would have had otherwise. Because remember, before this refinance, they had 17 years left just on their house alone, not considering the line of credit, the pool loan, or the credit card debt. So now by consolidating, we not only set them up with paying their house off early, but we also put their budget in a position where they've got this margin, they've got this extra money, so when something comes up now, they can move forward financially and not have to go backwards. So I hope you see how this solves their problems, both in the short and the long run. And this is something that I work with on, uh, with my clients on an ongoing basis. We do annual reviews to make sure that you're staying on track with these consolidation plans, that you're staying accountable to these plans that we set up, and that you don't veer off in any other direction. And if there's adjustments needed down the road, then so be it. But you need to get started on setting yourself up for that short and long-term success. So I hope you see how this can be a benefit to you or someone that you know. Please pass this video along, share it with others, comment below with your thoughts, questions, or concerns. Go ahead and follow me on all my social media channels. And if I can be of help to you or anyone that you know, reach out to me via call, text, or you can reach out via my social media private message. We'll talk to you soon and take care.